With many sunny fall days to come, a lot of golfers will hit the green to play. It's good to have a, a couple of courses, especially, you know, open to the public that you can frequent. Richard Lara has golfed for over 40 years, and if he has more than a couple hours, he'll drive hours to play on a good course. We go to Houston quite a bit, uh, Austin, San Antonio. In fact, uh, a couple of weeks ago, we played the TPC course in uh, San Antonio. Now, what the Texas A&M Golf Course Renovating Committee hopes is that their new course brings people here next year, instead of driving them out. Golfers will travel if they find that they have a course that's a unique experience for them. And we want to create something that will draw them in. What will make this course different from others in our area and around the state is its design. It's going to be something that's very traditional, uh, very early American style. That means few mounds and wide fairways. Something that you don't see a whole lot of in Texas because Texas's golf uh, was designed uh, a little later than what you saw up in the Northeast and in Chicago. Another reason designers say this course will attract people from all over the state and country is that even beginners like me can learn to play on this course. The variety of skill levels on different holes can create a more challenging course. That's something even seasoned golfers like Richard say is worth traveling for. I know from uh, out of town they would. Uh, if it's a nice course, they'll come to experience the course and other local businesses while they're here. Jenny Walsh, KAGS HD News.